Welcome. How wonderful to be here on this very special occasion. You have shown such great zeal and determination in your endeavors to remain in our pleasant land. But apparently, it's because I laugh and smile too much. That leaves all these stupid marks here around my face, around my eyes, around my mouth. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Like, this is the price of happiness. So I've decided I ain't gonna smile no more. But you know what they call them? Who? Clever people. Oh, wrinkles? No, clever people are far more poetic than that. Crow's feet. Not for mine. No, no. They call them the scars of time. <laughs> the scars of time. <laughs> Miss Tulsi, Senevery, <clears throat> Senevery at no, this is really hard. Miss Tulsi Seneveratne, have you understood the document we've presented you and are you ready to take the new citizenship test described? Um. You have won the right of freedom and free speech in our democratic society and we expect of you moral and social responsibilities by sharing, broadening, and responding to your communities, you vow to make this country better. Hello? June? What? Can you open the door so we can talk to you, please? Yes? Geriatric. We're home office with your new carer. Delivering your new carer? She's brown. She was sent back where she came from. June, please can you open the door? She's had a tough time. She wants to be productive. And she's really good with the senior people like you. And they're cleaning. OK. Nice one. Great. We'll leave you to it then. Now please stand for the oath of citizenship. Repeat after me. On becoming a citizen, I do solemnly, sincerely, and truly declare that on becoming a citizen, I do solemnly, sincerely, and truly declare that umkienoa umbava marula mata the kandakela. Okay. I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to Her Majesty the Queen and the state according to law. I, I will, will be faithful, faithful in the state to, to and solemnly the queen and, uh, uh, and, and the state according to law. Darling, that goes here. It was my husband's cricket bat. Husband. Oh, 
want me to cry? You and my husband for Christ's sake. Going somewhere? My dear Vice, I can get any to bed. If you walk away now, you will fail the test. You and your family will not be granted permission to remain in this country. Mama vegetarian. Fail? I'll mark her as a fail then. We're marking you as a failure of the new citizenship test. You and your children will be deported tonight. Is that your final decision? Hey, you're gone. Hmm? Deported. And now, for the national anthem. Glory be, land I see, faithful kingdom living in harmony. Land I mean, what's it even like? Pork, apparently. Is it? That's what they say. Who? The people that have tried it. Cannibals. Is it? Apparently. Fucking hell. I do like a good bacon butt in me, but you do need proper loads of ketchup just spilling out the sides and shit. I mean, a good bacon butty ain't the same without ketchup. Brown sauce. Mm -mm. I don't really do pork. It's way too fatty. Doesn't agree with my stomach. I mean, I shit barrels. <laughs> 